This is about the simplest possible antenna you can get for 10 meters. The antenna is actually a mobile whip for 27 megahertz. It's one to half meters long, but I've cut off about five centimeters of the wire at the top to make it resonant on about 28.4 megahertz. That's convenient for the SSB part of 10 meters. If you want it for 29 FM, make it even shorter. The antenna is mounted on a piece of pipe, about four or five meters high. Ground plane antennas normally use three or four radials, although strictly speaking, you only need two. I'm being even lazier and using only one, though be aware that will skew the radiation pattern. The radial used is fairly thick insulated wire, around 2.6 meters long. That's tied off at a handy point. This type of antenna will permit local communication up to around 40 or 50 kilometers, and also longer distance sporadic E, maybe a thousand to two thousand kilometers. 10, 20 or 30 watts will be adequate. You might work long distance DX, but conditions need to be very good. 10 meters can be volatile and signals can rise from nothing to strong back to nothing in a few minutes. Activity is also sporadic. To catch it, you should really be monitoring the band as much as possible. And for that reason, a dedicated transceiver on 10 meters will be extremely useful. An example is this Radio Shack or Tandy HTX10, which covers 10 meters only in AM, FM and SSB modes. Also handy is the squelch, which you can leave on a commonly used frequency. Here in Australia, 28.490 seems to be most active. Another thing you can do to gauge propagation is to tune various beacons. Beacons on 10 meters are found between 28.2 and 28.3 megahertz. There's international beacons on 28.2, several on the one frequency. They are timed to coordinate their transmissions so that you can get a trip around the world with various beacons being turned on in turn without you having to change frequency. They also have power levels which drop from 100 watts down to 100 milliwatts. Then there's beacons with their own frequency which are found up to 28.3. Here in Australia, a lot of beacons are around 28.260 and 28.270, and some frequencies in between. Also on 10 meters is FM, above 29 megahertz. A common frequency is 29.6. Another one is 29.2. There's also 10 meter repeaters. They have a 100 kilohertz offset with outputs between 29.62 and 29.68 with the inputs 100 kilohertz lower. FM is a volatile mode on 10 meters and isn't as effective as SSB. However, the clarity of signals can be excellent when conditions are good.